In this video, I want to help you fix your on Roku TV if you're having an issue getting connected to Wi-Fi. Now, this is pretty common with the on TV. Just follow me all the way to the end, and I'm pretty sure I can get you connected. So the first thing I want you to do is go to Home, and then scroll all the way down to Settings, and then from all the way down to Settings, you're going to go all the way down to System. Go to the right and then go to power. And then what you're going to do is you're going to system restart. So you're going to restart the on TV, turn it back on, and then see if that works. Next thing, what I want you to do is I want you to unplug the on TV. Just go in the back and then unplug it from the wall. And then locate the router the Wi-Fi router that you're connecting your on TV to and I want you to unplug it from the wall so that will disturb your Wi-Fi for everyone else in the house temporarily but I want you to keep them both unplugged for a good 10 minutes plug them both back in and then turn your on TV back on and then tell me if it works now if that doesn't work I want you to go to your Wi-Fi router and test another device on it, like uh, your smartphone or a laptop or some other device, and see if something else is working on it. If it doesn't, then you know the issue is not with your on TV, but the issue is with that router. So again, unplugging it probably should have done the trick. If it didn't, then I want you. What I want you to do is test that router and actually connect something to it via the Ethernet. If you can connect your on TV to the Ethernet or to the router via uh, Ethernet by cord, that's preferable. And then you're able to see if you, you can get a, get a connection. Um, you may have to contact the service provider and then see, hey, is there a temporary outage in the area, which could be the issue. All right, next thing what I want you to do is go back to home. And then what we're going to do is go all the way back down to settings. And then we'll go to network. And then what I want you to do is click check connection. And I want you to test your connection. Okay, and that will let you know if everything's connected. And if not, then we'll go to the next solution. Go back to network. And then what I want you to do is go to setup connection. Okay, so this particular one I'm using, CenturyLink. I want you to hit enter. And what I want you to do now is if this is, if you verify that this is your, whatever you're using, your Wi Fi, whatever Wi Fi uh, network that you're using, what I want you to do is select it and then I want you to clear password. And what that's going to do is that's going to reset the, the Wi Fi to where you have to re enter everything. Make sure you remember what the password is. And then relocate, relocate the um, the network on your networks, and then re-enter the password, and then see if that works. That should fix it for ninety percent of you if you've tried everything up to now. Now, if you haven't tried that, try another network, uh, another Wi-Fi source on your. On your on, I would suggest maybe a smartphone. So if you're teething and you have a hot spot on your on your cell phone, try that. And of course, you know to do that, you just go to settings and then you go to hot and then you go to hot spot, and then you connect and then you enter your password into here, and then see if you're able to work to to, to go on to your smartphone. If not, it may be an issue actually with with the Wi-Fi router. And you might have to get a new Wi-Fi router. Most likely, it's not your TV that's the issue. All right. If you've tried all that, all that else fails. What you're going to have to do is go to Home. Go all the way down to Settings. And then what you're going to have to do is go all the way down to System. Go to the right. Go all the way down to Software Update. And try a Software Update. Now, most likely, that's not going to work, right? Because you're not getting internet connection. So, what you're going to have to do is go to Advanced Systems Settings, and go to Factory Reset, 
and reset everything. Now what that's going to do, it's going to make it like it's out of the box, like you bought it brand new. It's going to wipe out all the new apps that you put on there, any of your passwords, all that. It's like it's brand new. But that will fix the rest of your problems if you're not able to get connected to Wi-Fi. All right, thanks so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe.